Hello, Aquarius. How are you doing this heavenly tea? I finally made it to your readings. I was supposed to start this morning, but of course I wasn't able to. I had to take care of things. So, hey, here I am now. I hope you guys are doing well. Okay, let's continue praying for each other in this crazy time we're going through. Hey, Aquarius, I'm seeing cartwheels. Somebody just flipping cartwheels. I take that as elated, happy. Somebody's happy. The wheel of fortune. There's fortune. Good fortune. Coming your way. Something. Good news. You know, I just see cartwheels. Somebody's turning cartwheels. Cartwheels. Okay. So that, the, the wheel of fortune. Okay. Good fortune coming. Bill's turning in your favor. Happily. So, some of you guys are getting some good news about something. Or something that you wanted to um, come into fruition is coming into fruition for you, okay? Happiness. I'm elated. Okay, Holy Spirit, um, show us Aquarius's energy. Show us Aquarius's energy. Okay, that one. Okay, then these cards are going to go funky. Man. Okay, we have the Hermits. Okay, we have Judgment. Wow. Power. Okay, the Ace of Swords. Um, the Six of Pentacles. I got my glasses. The Two of Pentacles. And um, the Nine of Swords. Okay, so. Some of you guys need to use your intuition in a situation, okay? So you you will get knowledge on what you need to see, okay? So you will be enlightened, okay? So you need to spend some time to yourself in solitude and get some enlightenment on something you need to be seeing, okay? A tower moment that you're going through. Some of you guys are going through a tower moment, okay? So you need um, to use your intuition to guide you through this tower moment. You need some enlightenment, okay? Because this is going to be a new beginning for you. Ace of, Ace of Swords, okay? When you get this clarity, you're going to be given some clarity. Once you spend some time to yourself, get this enlightenment by using your intuition, your clarity is going to come in this time of need during this tower moment, okay? And this is going to be your new beginning, okay? And this is going to help you in an area where you may be feeling like you're going to have to give out too much money to someone. And this, this is going to help balance you out, okay? There you go. Balance, card of balance. You won't have to juggle, okay? Your stability. This is something concerning your stability, okay? So some of you guys are concerned that you're gonna you're you're gonna have to give out too much money in the area, whether it be somebody's going through a divorce and they're worried about they're having to give too much money to their partner, okay? You need to go um in solitude, use your intuition, let it guide you, let it give you some knowledge and enlightenment on how to move forward in this situation, okay? It could be somebody could have lost the job, okay? And you're trying to find a way to have to budget, you know, so you don't have to give out too much money during this time, okay? Because we are going through this time of this virus. So, yeah, a lot of people have lost their jobs, okay? So they're worried about money. They're trying to um, penny pinch, 
All right? Use your intuition on how to balance. Have balance in this time. All right? Yeah, worry. This situation has some of you guys up worrying at night. Holy Spirit, clarify this nine of swords. Wow. The Empress. You're worried about your um family. Some of you guys are worried about taking care of your family member. How are you going to take care of your family member? Your um, person, your spouse, kids. King of Swords. Stand your ground in this situation. Holy Spirit, clarify. Yeah, stand your ground in this situation. It'll be okay. When I seen the cartwheels, the wheels turning in your favor. It's going to turn in your favor. I'm thinking that's why I was seeing the wheel because it's, it's telling me it's going to turn. Whoever this is, the wheel's going to turn in your favor, okay? You're going to be okay. Everything's going to be okay. Yeah. Let me clarify. Holy Spirit, clarify the hermit. Oh, no. <laughs> okay. So you got the seven of swords. Okay, some of you guys need to use your intuition on somebody that's being sneaky, trying to get away with something. Holy Spirit, clarify the judgment. Clarify the judgment. Yeah. Somebody may be stealing from you. Holy Spirit, clarify this judgment. Three cards came out. Let's clarify. The King of Cups. Okay, some of you guys need to get some enlightenment about somebody that's offering you some emotion. Okay, you may be going through a separation. It's a cancer. Okay. Three of Swords. Or this person could have you in a third party situation. Or could have had five of wands, and this is what caused some arguments and disharmony between you guys. Okay. You need to get some intuition on this situation. You need you need to use your intuition, go in solitude. Yeah, this person is, whoever it is, this King of Cups, they're being sneaky, okay? And they may be trying to offer, coming in, trying to offer you some emotions, but they may still have you in a third-party situation. Or they could be thinking of separating from you and due to you guys arguing and the disharmony between you guys, okay? Power moment. So there's a tower moment um, coming. Holy Spirit, clarify this tower. Wow. And Aquarius' energy. So maybe this person might be, if 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 it's not a third party situation, maybe they're tired of you fussing and arguing between you two. Okay. And they're thinking about separating from you. Okay. Or it has them. Um, has them thinking of separating, all right? The tower moment. Holy Spirit, clarify the tower. Okay. 
Or you may. <clears throat> okay, Eight of Swords. Okay. So there's a tower moment. Or this person, they're going through a tower moment. They may be going through a tower moment. And they're mentally trapped. Okay? They're mentally trapped. They don't know what to do. Or making a decision. Holy Spirit, clarify this uh, Eight of Swords. Hmm. Okay, they're mentally trapped about somebody they want to reunite with. It, it could be family. Okay, it could be somebody else. Four, four wands. Okay. Or about how to get balance between you and them. Okay. There, you, there goes the wheel, the wheel of fortune. Okay, they want good luck in this situation. Okay. So this could be how you're feeling. You think you're, you may be being told as well. You need to use your intuition about somebody that you think is sneaky. Okay, you need to get some enlightenment on this person, this King of Cups that you may be thinking is sneaky or still doing things behind your back. You may just be thinking that they have you in a third party situation. Okay, it's not that they do. It may be you thinking that they are. Okay. The five of wands, and this is causing you guys disharmony and arguments between each other, okay? It's causing a tower moment, okay? And this person is mentally trapped in this cycle that they're going through with you. And they don't, they want to balance things out with you. They're trying to balance things out. Okay, yeah, that's what's going on. This is, yeah. They want to balance things out. They want the wheel to turn in their favor. They want good luck. There goes that wheel, you guys. Okay? They want to fix things between you. But that's why you need to use your intuition. Let the Holy Spirit, your higher power, guide you, show you what's going on. Don't assume. Let your higher power guide you and show you if this person is still doing these things. Okay? Because they want balance. Your partners want balance with you where you're thinking that they're still doing these things and they, they may not be doing these things, okay? They're wanting to balance things out with you. They want the will to turn in their favor. They want good luck in offering you emotion. They're trying to offer you emotion, okay? All right? And maybe you're holding back with this person because it's hard for you to trust them. You're scared to trust them, maybe, you know? Because you're scared you're going to get hurt again. Or that. And it doesn't have to be a um, a cancer. It could be whatever sign. If it's resonating, that's what's going on with your person. Okay? So use your intuition on what's going on with this person. Okay? Because they're trying to offer you emotion. Okay? And they're thinking they may need to separate as well because you keep somebody, you might be keep bringing up the same thing, causing disharmony, arguments, and it's causing a tower moment. But they want balance. You're being told all they want is balance and they want the will of fortune. I'm sorry I keep repeating it, but yeah, you need clarity. You need to get some clarity. Okay, so you guys can have a new beginning. Your person wants a new beginning, and you need to get clarity so you guys can start your new beginning on what's going on, what they're doing, or have they changed? You need clarity. You want clarity, okay, on have they changed or not, okay? But they're wanting a new beginning with you. Ace of Swords, okay? Holy Spirit, clarify this Ace of Swords. Yep, there you go. The two of wands. There you go. Look, they got the world in their hand. 
They want to start a new beginning. This person wants to give you the world. I'm going to say they want to offer you the world. That's all they want to do. They want to have a new beginning with you on starting again. Two of wands offering you the world. They hold the world in their hand. They choose you, Aquarius. See? Look at this. All right. The Six of Pentacles. They want to give you attention. Holy Spirit. They just want to give all to you. You the attention. This is them handing this to you. The Six of Pentacles. Holy Spirit, clarify the Six of Pentacles. Clarify this Six of Pentacles. Clarify this Six of Pentacles in Aquarius's energy. I'm hearing they're trying. They're trying. They're trying to work things out. You have to open up the trust. Eight of Cups. All right. Walking away. They want to give you everything so you don't walk away from them. They want balance. Or they're walking away from other cups. They're giving all to you. They're walking away from all these other cups. Look at that. They changed. They're walking away to give you balance between. They want balance in the relationship. The two of pentacles. Holy Spirit, clarify the two of pentacles. Clarify this two of pentacles. Yeah, they want balance, but you got them blocked, Queen of Swords. But you got them cut off. You have your guard up with this person. You need to let your guard down. Because this person is just wanting a new beginning. They're trying to make things work. They're giving everything to you. They got the world in their hand, handing it to you, offering it to you. Okay? They're trying to get the balance back in the relationship, but you have them cut off. You have your guard up. You need to let your guard down with this person. Okay? This is them. They worry you about the relationship. They stay up nights worrying about how to work this thing out with you. Holy Spirit, clarify the Nine of Swords. Clarify the Nine of Swords and Aquarius' energy. Wow. Ace of Cups. There you go. They worry about getting this new beginning with you. Ace of Cups. They worry about not getting this new beginning with you. The Hermit, they see you as their empress. They don't want to lose their family. This is how they see you. Beautiful. Loving, kind. They want their family. They see you as the empress. They put you on the pedestal. You're on the pedestal, Aquarius. This person, whoever you're dealing with, they put, they put you on a pedestal. Holy Spirit, clarify the empress. Wow. So the first part that I was reading before I clarified the cards, this is how it was. This is what the person did to you in the beginning. So it's showing what they want now. So you may have went through that with the person. The first spread, before I clarified it, that's what you went through with this person. But this is what they want now. They want to work things out. Holy Spirit, clarify the Empress. Wow. Clarify the Empress. In Aquarius's energy, get your clarity. Get your um. Okay, the nine of one, nine of wands. Okay, this person is going through a struggle getting this new beginning with you. They're exhausted, but they're almost through it. They're almost there. Okay, they're exhausted. Okay, they're holding on for dear life. Look, they're holding on to you for dear life. Look at that. Look at that. Their head bandaged up. Look. 
They're exhausted, wore out, trying to hold on to you. The King of Swords. Let that guard down. They're standing their ground. This person is standing their ground. Okay, this is what they're doing. They're not giving up. They're standing their ground. Okay, Aquarius, you may need to let your guard down. But get that, you know, go in hermit mode. Use your intuition. Ask your higher power to show you. So you can let, let go of that fear. Okay, this person is stand, standing their ground seven, with you, seven of cups. All right. No other is like you. Seven of Cups. No other. They had all these other options. But guess what? They they seen that none of them was viable. None of them were like you. None. None of them were like you. Okay? They're giving all to you. So this is beautiful. Beautiful, Aquarius. You just need to let your guard down, babe. All right? I hope you guys enjoyed the read. This was the end of the read. Please be good. I love you guys. Let's continue to keep each other in prayers. Like, share this video. Subscribe, you guys. And welcome to any new viewers that I may have. Uh, welcome to my channel. Thank you for stepping into my channel. All right. Please subscribe. I'd love to have you as a subscriber. God bless you guys. I hope you enjoyed this read. I love you guys. All right. Good night.